In this sprawling megacity, the population has been growing for decades. So has the demand for water. A lot of it is wasted because of leaks in underground pipes. Experts say in some parts of the capital, up to 40% of potable water is lost. Water shortages in poorer parts of the city have already led to riots. Stability in Mexico City depends on the availability of water. But the effects of water shortages in this capital, built on a series of ancient lakes, are visible. A golden angel stands watch over Mexico City's main boulevard, Paseo de la Reforma. The surface of the boulevard was at this level when the monument to Mexico's independence was inaugurated in 1910. With the passage of time, 112 years, this part of the city has been receding. 22 stairs. That's a drop of more than three meters and a graphic example of just how much this city has been sinking. With huge amounts of water pumped out of the ground each day, damage to the city's infrastructure is increasing. Geologists worry that these problems taken together could reach a crisis point if this region suffers prolonged droughts. This has obviously intensified with climate change. In some places we have an increase in rainfall, and in other places we have a decrease in rainfall. These changes break the balance. One of the impacts of climate change, the most important impacts of climate change is related to water. Uh, and that's the same case in many other cities where there is an overexploitation of the aquifer. So. Still, millions of residents go about their lives apparently unaware of the potential for disaster. Experts say they must be educated on better water management techniques. And efforts to capture rainwater must be implemented. Frank Contreras, CGTN, Mexico City.